the Bean Farmer here. Today is uh, Saturday, October the 13th. Uh, Thursday afternoon, early evening, mostly afternoon, Hurricane Michael, the remnants of it, downgraded to a tropical storm by the time it got here, rolled across the little farm. And uh, this was my weeping willow tree down here by the uh, ditch where all the water came out of this place. Well, the winds that uh, were still in that uh, storm were about 50 mile an hour as it rolled through here. And I'm learning now that uh, weeping willow trees don't have a big long tap root. They just looks like they just got surface runner roots. But the wind got my tree and blowed it over here. And uh, I'm gonna miss this tree. I planted this thing when I first moved over here. and. It was probably four or five foot tall when I when I dug a hole and stuck it in the ground. And I enjoyed watching it grow. It had some interesting limb shapes to it. But now it's a cleanup project. So I've got my little saw down here. Start cutting limbs off and just drag them over here to my brush pile and get this cleaned up. The beans, like I said, this is October the 13th. And the beans didn't suffer. They, I wasn't here, I was at work, so I don't know, but it just looks to me like they did a wind dance. Uh, I don't see anything horribly blown over, laid over. Um, they're, they're just here. And that's what group seven beans look like on October the 13th down here in North Carolina. Now, group seven, late maturity. And I've mentioned it before, I won't be cutting these beans until um, end of November, December time frame. Got a little bit of stinking morning glory in here, but nothing like previous years. My aunt used to say, that's such a pretty flower. Yeah, but a little bit got up in there. So it still looks like we've got a bean crop down here. Um, Everybody, thanks for watching my videos. I need to make use of what little bit of light I got left to uh, start cleaning up this tree mess here. I don't really like it laying across this ditch. This ditch is the main channel for the water to come out of here, come down through this ditch and then through that culvert right there and uh, under my driveway and out on the other side. So let me get a little saw and go to work here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Still alive down here in North Carolina on the little farm.